Guys, I really apologise about cutting out, but this is part two of continuing on from part one. As you can see, this has a much bigger voice coil. This is a subwoofer only, so I'm actually going to turn the treble off. So the treble's all the way down and just a bass on this thing, because it is only a subwoofer. So I'm going to begin that now. So I've just turned the treble all the way down and we shall begin. Hang on guys. Sorry about that guys. I fixed the issue. This is at the same volume, it's just got the treble all the way down and the bass all the way up. So yeah, let's get on to the next speaker. Here is the next speaker, it's an Awa. So yeah, let's begin with the same song. With trouble back up full. So bad, guys, I had to get rid of the fluff on there. So yeah, I'll end this here, and I'll put you on to the next speaker, which will be the Wolfdale. So here is the Wolfdale, as you guys can see. Yeah, let's begin. So yeah, next speaker guys, which will be the last, it is a 50 watt speaker, next. Here is the last speaker, this is a LG 3 ohm 50 watt sub. As you can see, very decent voice coil, very nice spider, and uh, yeah, very heavy. So yeah, as you can see, 3 ohm 50 watt, this I will be doing this because it is a subwoofer. So that's where the volume is, where it's been with all the others, with the bass maxed. Let's begin. This is the last speaker. <laughs> Sorry about that guys, sometimes stuff goes on it. Oh, 
This amp really can't handle the power that this sub needs. Which is a shame really. But when you go inside the box it really does kick on the bass. So yeah guys, I hope you enjoyed the video on all of these speakers, comment which one you think had the best excursion and also what one you thought was the best um, bass or sound on. Anyway, hope you enjoyed this video guys, goodbye.